All window films are applied to the inside of the window, unless they are specified as exterior films. Exterior films are specially designed for application on the outside of the window. Window films come in two parts, the film that is applied to the window and a backing liner. If you hang film with the backing still on, you'll likely find it on the floor within a few hours. This is the easiest way to remove the liner and keep the film from creasing. Pick a corner of the film you've cut and apply a piece of tape to each side on the corner. Have the tapes face each other and be slightly off center. Press the tape to the film firmly, then pull the tapes apart and this will release the backing. Place tape on the exposed corners to anchor the film as you release the backing. If you have someone helping you, simply have them anchor the film down. Remove the backing slowly, corner to corner, and spray soapy solution on the backing as you go. This helps to keep the film from sticking to itself and causing problems. Using plenty of your soapy solution helps in handling the film. Separating the liner may cause a static charge that makes the film want to stick to itself. To reduce static, spray the soap and water solution generously onto the film's adhesive side as you pull off the liner. Cover the entire sheet of film you will be handling. If the film sticks to itself, that piece will be wasted, so make sure you use plenty of solution on the film and glass. You'll squeegee it out once the film is set. Window film is commonly applied by a single person, but having a helper can be a great benefit. This is especially true on windows over 30 inches in width. A second person can be particularly helpful when removing the liner and placing the film on the glass. The larger the window, the more you'll be glad that you have an assistant during these steps. When removing the liner, have your helper hold down the corners of the film when you have separated the liner. They can help keep the film from moving while you pull the backing liner off and spray the film with the solution. When placing the film, have your helper grab one corner of the film and you grab the other. Place the film on the glass as you normally would, position it, and set it with your squeegee. Then let your helper stand back and watch you work your magic. One common issue people face when applying window film for the first time is that there isn't enough soapy solution being used on the glass and film. Do not use this sparingly. Use plenty of solution until both the window and film are saturated. This will help you move the film into place after placing it on the glass. No matter how much solution you use, it's squeegeed out, so you really can't use too much. But you can definitely use not enough. When squeegeeing your window film, hold the squeegee at a 30 to 45 degree angle to the window. Giving the film a light spray on the surface of the film helps the squeegee glide across the film with a smooth motion. Start at the center and work your way out to the edge with smooth overlapping strokes and medium pressure. When finished, Wrap the squeegee in paper towels and use it to gather remaining water at the edges next to the frame. Small water bubbles will disappear as the film dries and adheres completely over the next few days. Allow 72 hours of curing time before wiping or cleaning the glass where you've installed film. Window film may be removed by using a fabric steamer or hair dryer to loosen the adhesive. Hair dryers may take a bit more time than steamers. Heat the film until you are able to pull it away from the glass. Removing the film in strips of six to eight inches will be easier than removing the film in one full sheet. Once you get the film loose, cut a notch in it to get your rip started. Pull the film slowly for best results.
Continue this process until all the strips of film are removed. Remaining adhesive residue can be cleaned using a soap and water solution and scraping it with a razor blade. Removing a static cling film doesn't require any heat. It can be removed and rolled up and stored for later use.